Hello friends, welcome to my channel. This is Charan. Let's continue the JavaScript tutorial series. Now, uh, in this video tutorial, I will explain how to filter a records, the HTML tables, using the JavaScript and CSS tab. So let's start the tutorial. And here we got the final output of our application. Notice filter by gender, all male and female. If I click male notice i got filtered male only if i click female here we got the female if i click all i got all based on the drop down list i'm selecting i'm filtering the data and data male or female or if you want to display all for this video tutorial i'm using visual studio code first let's open our folder which is a javascript iphone tutorials and here it is our folder is added to the vs explorer let me expand this folder now inside this folder i will create one new html file called filter table a table using drop down list ddl.htm and here we got the newly created html file is open now let me minimize this vs explorer as well as i'm closing this welcome page which i don't require now let's start the coding part first i'm adding the doc type html inside the html element i'm adding header section after the header section i'm adding the body tags now inside this body tag i'm adding one central element the h1 filter the filter the table the table using let's add the student table filter the student table uh, using um, javascript with the drop down list first with the drop down list with drop down with the drop down list using javascript and css let's add the horizontal line small line, small letters and horizontal line now after the horizontal line i'm adding one label uh, label um, for gender label for for gender let's add the filter by gender filter by gender now here i'm adding the select option elements select id is equals to id is the gender now let's add the options also option value here i'm defining all when a user selects the all from this drop down list i want to display all the records from the html table option value is equals to male I want to display mail when a user display female I want to display female that's it now after that I'm adding one horizontal and now we require one table table ID is equals to which is a student table let's add the student hyphen table student icon table table head table headers table row ph student name student name ph gender and ph let's add the age just for the demo purpose i'm adding only three columns student name gender and age because i want to filter the record based on the gender gender after the table i'm adding the t body table body In the table body i'm adding tr table data is charan td male td is around 32 now let's copy this one four five 
five student details I have added here. Karan, James, Mill is around the thirty-five. Lalita, she is female. She is thirty. Mm. Vijay, male, twenty-eight. Raju, that's the um, Rani, female. She is twenty years old. And the last one is I'm adding James. James, male, around thirty-four. That's it. We have done that. Uh, we have just created the table. Now we require um, the script element. Let's add this script after the center element. Script. Script. Let's define one function. Filter table. Filter table. This filter table. Uh, table I'm adding here um, on change is let's add this filter table let's add this filter table filter table come to the bottom now let's declare one variable drop down mm, variable drop down is equals to document that get element by id first we need to base on this select elements select optional options i am adding um, gender here the id of the select option element variable selected value let's add the selected value is equals to drop down that value now there's variable declare table if a user selects all i want to display all the records if a user selects a male i want to display only the male records like that i need to filter the table so now we require the document dot get element by id i need to add this uh, student table student table let's copy this one and paste here now i need to filter the rows so rows is equals to declare a variable table dot get element get element the tag name so table rows i want to tag which is tr table rows i want to display filter the rows again for loop now for loop for i is equals to one i is less than uh, rows dot length length i plus plus i plus plus variable row is equals to rows i then variable gender is equals to row dot cells one dot text content text content dot trim trim Now after that, we need to write the actual logic. If selected value the table equals to so all all is this one this value. If we use a select this one all copy this one all I want to display uh, all the records or gender. Gender is equals to this gender based on the rows. Triple equals to selected value. This value we are selecting from the drop drop down. Selected value. Selected value. Row dot style dot display. Display is equals to empty. Else part row dot style dot display none
that's it we have done the javascript functionality now we will add some styles here style border let's add the table table uh, table element border uh, collapse let's add the border collapse is collapse text align in the table i want to make center table headers tdh and td padding and 10 pixels let's add the uh, 8 pixels let's add 8 pixels border and um, border 1 pixel solid black p head background color the background color i'm adding i'm adding let's add the chocolate white chocolate white and the text color is equals to um, a light blue and also let's add the um, table screen ID and also let's add the select option element gender let's copy this one drop down list let's add the drop down list ID you know we need to add the hash hash gender background color background let's add the multiple colors background background linear gradient to right red red white blue let's add the green green white green white orange blue let's uh, change the colors let's change the colors let's the blue light blue yeah that's it and the border radius also we require border radius is 15 pixels text font size font size is uh, large text align text align in the drop down list is center that's it we have done the complete coding part let's save this file file save we'll check the final output of our application for that open file explorer the folder i have created in the e drive um, this is javascript iphone tutorials this is a folder name and the filter table drop down list ddl this is our file name let's open that one and here we got the final output of our application notice filter by gender all male and female if i click male notice i got filtered male only if i click female here we got the female if i click all i got all based on the drop down list i'm selecting i'm filtering the data and data male or female or if you want to display all that's it in this video tutorial i have explained how to filter a html table with a drop down list using javascript and css styles thanks for watching this video tutorial please subscribe share and leave your valuable comment we will catch you in my next video tutorial